The land along Egypt's Nile Delta is becoming more salty, making the soil difficult to farm. Imad Atiyah Ramadan used to grow tomatoes on his plot on the edge of the Egyptian city of Damietta. These days, he plants rice instead. Ramadan is one of tens of thousands of farmers racing to adapt to encroaching salinity in the Nile Delta, caused partly by climate change that has raised sea levels. The Nile Delta is a densely populated and fertile triangle of green that accounts for more than a third of Egypt's agricultural land. Experts say rising salinity in the delta has multiple causes, including over-extraction of groundwater and excessive use of fertilizers and pesticides. But they say it's being made worse by climate change that has already raised sea levels and temperatures in Egypt. Local farmers have several options for adaption. They range from creating raised beds to improving irrigation efficiency and drainage to planting new crops. But some struggle to treat and rinse the soil as they experiment with new crops. Irregular rainfall and a lack of fresh water for irrigation don't help and hotter temperatures every year accelerate evaporation, further concentrating the salt. Farm manager Hossam El Azabawi says soil salinity can cut yields in half for even the most resistant of crops. This year, he has experimented with a new strain of rice that gives an 18% higher yield. Globally, Egypt is the fifth most vulnerable country to the economic impact of sea level rise on cities. That's according to a World Bank report published in November 2022. Sea levels have been rising by 3.2 millimetres annually since 2012 in the country. Experts at the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization say that will likely push the line of salinity down deeper into the delta. A study published in 2021 calculated that 60% of a 450-kilometer square area in the northeast of the delta would be negatively affected by rising groundwater linked to sea level rise by the end of the century. For now, farmers like Ramadan and El Azabawi are continuing to find new ways to adapt. فالملوحة برضو من الأمراض أو من المشاكل اللي بتواجه المزارعين في مصر بشكل كبير وعلاجها كعلاج للملوحة موضوع صعب وطويل. اللي زي ما قلنا المعالجات الملوحة برضو مسكنات تبقى شغل بس بديد تأثيرها في وقت الري فقط لا غير. يعني بس بتخلي البيئة حوالين الجذور في وقت الري بس شوية العناصر شوية البيئة سهلة للامتصاص إنما بعيد عن كده ما فيش علاج جذري للملوحة سريع أو حل جذري سريع لا بتاخد شغل كتير ومحتاجة شغل كتير ومصاريف كتير عشان تتعالج